It is the greatest cruelty of life that we're all too swiftly taken from it. We age, we decay, we die. But what do we leave behind? Bones? Dust? What of the soul? Does it endure beyond our earthly existence? I believe it does. A truth lies at the heart of many myths and stories. A truth not of science, but something more profound. The key to unlocking everlasting life. I may have found the next piece to the puzzle, but I'm not alone in this search. They're following me, watching my every step. I know them by name now. Trinity. An ancient, violent sect with designs on controlling the future of humanity. I must proceed carefully for the sake of my family. If anything were to ever happen to Lara or Anna, I could never forgive myself. the gutter press was attacking you again. I thought you could use some company. No lies. Were you followed? Followed? Of course not. What's going on? I think I found the tomb. Oh, you can't be serious. The myth of the prophet is real. Dad was right. Lara, your father was unwell. No. He was close to a great discovery, tangible evidence of the immortal soul. I loved Richard. I would have married him if he'd asked. But he was a broken man. I don't want to see you end up like him. But Anna, he was right. It was everyone else who was wrong. The tomb's in Syria. Syria? Oh God, Laura, no. This is madness. Get your life sorted. Go home to the manor. You know I can't go back there. But this obsession ruined your father. I saw something. Something I... I can't explain. Now I understand what Dad was going through. It's all fairy tales. Nonsense. Don't go down this road. You know where it leads. It's the only thing that makes sense to me now. I'm going to find the Prophet's tomb, Anna. Hey, we're heading into a war zone now. We better be sure about this. We're close. There should be an oasis in the canyon just ahead. You're wasting your time. There's nothing out here. Just keep driving, please. It's your money. Something isn't right. Oh, that's just local militia. You told someone, didn't you? They, they paid better than you! You both! Damn! This road! Shit! They weren't supposed to shoot at us! 
Get us out of here! Shit! Shit! Get out! No, no, no! research about this. It was said the Prophet's tomb was hidden in the cliffs above one of the forgotten cities. Legend speaks of an oasis where the Prophet was laid to rest. Religious icon, detailed and inlaid with gems. It looks Byzantine, perhaps 10th century. Could this really be it? healing miracles. Dad's notes mentioned this. These are the miracles of the Prophet of Constantinople, unjustly murdered by order of Trinity. He led his followers through the desert to the oasis. Still no sign. I don't think she survived the crash. All right, let's go. Constantine wants to breach the tomb before sundown. <sighs> They're after the tomb. I've got to find it before them. It's the Prophet, speaking with a foreign army. He convinced them to lay down their weapons. Hmm. Greek is still a little rusty, but it's pointing to something hidden nearby. I'll mark down the locations. Secret. 
have seen this. pursued the prophet and his people relentlessly until finally confronting them in their hidden oasis. religious pilgrims. The Order of Trinity. The Prophet slain by the Order of Trinity. My son, the Order of Trinity has received word that the Prophet's followers are building a great tomb at an oasis outside Berea. But more upsetting, while we thought they were building the tomb for their prophet, Trinity now believes he still lives. We have learned he is preaching his heresy among the local citizens, drawing more to him daily with his tales of how he conquered death. He is a liar and a heretic, claiming miracles that come only from the divine. You swore he was dead. Have you failed us? That was too close. They're blasting their way in. Let's hope this works.
morning. We made it, Dad. Another religious symbol, but this one is simple and handmade. The prophet must have drawn followers from every walk of life. My lord, what you say is impossible. I myself drove a spear into the Prophet's heart. I saw him die. Doubtless his people have propped another man up in the slain Prophet's robe to continue his lies. They are broken, discredited, and exiled. We will head south, and put the rest of his people to the sword. But the Prophet is dead. This... I swear. My lord, I ride at the head of a small army of the faithful, armed and ready. And I have good news. We have located the tomb of the Prophet. We were attacked by madmen upon the road, wearing the Prophet's livery, but they were easily bested. We allowed one to flee, and followed him back to the Oasis. Whether the Prophet escaped death, or whether another now wears his mantle, it does not matter. All will perish inside and it will become a tomb at last. My lord, 
The last remnant of the Prophet's followers have barricaded themselves inside his tomb. We have made camp at the entrance, and we are preparing to break through their barricades. I saw the man claiming to be the Prophet before they sealed the gates, and I admit, he bears a striking resemblance. But it could not be. No matter. They will all be dead before sunrise. The Order of Trinity will see that his heresy ends here. Charges! The Prophet's tomb. After all this time. And the artifact? Inside. God willing. Open it. Carefully. It could be extremely dangerous. Who the hell are you? You're a smart woman. I suspect you already know. Trinity. Where is the artifact? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play games with me! You led us to this place. Look, it was empty when I got here. There was no body and definitely no artifact. Get down! 